guys welcome back to another video uh, I'm so glad to have you back in here and if you are new here uh, welcome I like doing decorating videos DIYs and much more uh, but in today's video we are doing some fall Dollar Tree DIYs so make sure you stay to the end of this video For this first DIY, I'm using some flowers, which are optional, some fall leaves, this metal stem from Dollar Tree, white craft paint, some twine rope, and this three splatter screen from Dollar Tree. So the first thing that I'm doing is forming a pumpkin with a splatter screen and I decided to paint them white but this step is totally up to you. As you can see, I only left one handle to one of the splatter screen and it's the middle one so I will be wrapping the handle with my twin rope. And at this point, I decided not to use the flowers so I will only be using the follies and I'm going to be gluing them to the very bottom where the splatters and the handle meet. I decided to give it a touch of orange so I will be only adding a little bit of orange to all of the edges of the splatters and lastly I will be gluing my harvest sign. And this is how my splatter screen pumpkin came out. This pumpkin is great to be displayed in your kitchen or in your doors. For this second DIY, I'm using this clear shot glasses from Dollar Tree, some spackling from Dollar Tree, some pumpkin spice and also cinnamon sticks. Also, I am using some piping bags or you can use a zip bag uh, and also this orange and brown craft paint to achieve my pumpkin color. And I'm going to begin by painting the inside of my cups orange. I am now cutting a piece of paperboard to glue into the top of my cup before I add the spackling whipped cream. I added a bit of water to my spackling to make it a little bit softer and from here I'm going to add the spackling into my piping bag so I can start forming the whipped cream. Now I'm just adding my cinnamon sticks and also I will be adding a bit of pumpkin spice on the top of my whipping cream and there you go you got your pumpkin spice latte and for this next DIY I got this wooden board and also this wooden cubes from Dollar Tree all I'm doing for this DIY is picking up four wooden cubes and gluing them to the bottom of my wood board I 
I decided to go with this medium brown craft paint and I will be painting my riser. This little riser is great for candles, plants or a little pumpkin right now for fall. Moving into the last DIY, I pick up this frame from Dollar Tree and this fall window stickers. I decided to paint my frame white but I will only be using the frame and the glass but this is totally up to you if you want to keep the back as well. You probably can't really tell but I have my frame and my glass ready and I'm adding some of the stickers to my glass. Uh, this is a very simple DIY and it's probably my favorite one. And to finish it up, I'm adding some black paint to the edges of my frame to make a little distress. And this is going to be the end of today's video. Hopefully you guys liked today's video and if you guys did, make sure you do a thumbs up. And also don't forget to share this video with your family and friends and see you guys next time.